subscribe for Barry Science Lab. And today, we are going to solve Math 06 on trigonometry lessons. Yeah, I think that's what it's called. Oh, the, Pythag the Pythagorean theorem is A squared plus B squared is C squared. A squared, root 2 squared, and B squared is also root 2. So that's another root 2 squared equals C squared, and we don't know. So, root 2 squared, that's 2, and root 2 squared, that's also 2. So 2 plus 2 is x squared. That means x squared is 4. And now we know that C is actually 2. Now we know that C is actually 2, but we have to solve the other problems too. So now we have to find C by the law of sine. The law of sine is sine. Also, we need the angles for this one. So this is a 45 angle, this is a 90 angle, and this is also a 45 angle. So we are going to lay, label this one A since uh, the side A, lowercase a, is um, opposite to this one. B, this one is, well, I think I need to stand up on my tippy toes. This one is B, and the one here is C. So, let's find C by the law of sine. So sine, capital A over A equals sine, Capital B over B <laughs> equals sine capital C over C. And we, we can uh, cancel out either one of sine A or sine B fractions, like either of these. <laughs> because, like, we know that A is the capital B. So, I'll just uh, cross out the beaks, so uh, yeah, odd ones out. So, now we can do basically a cross multiplication. So, sine C, sine A, and this one is A times sine uh, uh, no C so we know that A that this A is root 2 sine C that means sine 90 zero C so that's sine 90 and sine 90 is 1 equals 2 C, we don't know C, so let's just use X. Sine A, so that's sine 45, which means root 2 over 2, I believe. Is it not? So, and then, um, we cancel these out. So two root two over two root two equals x. So x equals two. Hmm. Seems like there's another way to do it, huh? Now the third way to do it. Find c by the law of cosine. D squared equals um, A squared plus B squared minus 2AB. And then um, sine A, sine A, sine A, sine B, sine C. But um, sine A and sine B, we know they are the same. So let's just do sine A, sine C. So, 